Unasikia mtu anasema ati unasikia mtu anasema ati ati alikuwa anaona watu wengine na anasema ni take responsibility za nini? Siko na bibi na familia mimi nilikuwa nifanye nini? So, no, yeah. it was clear mimi nilikuwa clande. Yeah, we were going to take things serious. So, nilikuwa nikae hapo nikikosmailia kila saa. Alikuwa anataka ukuwe faithful to him. That is what he wanted. Uh-huh. Nikuwa faithful kwake uh-huh. na yeye kila saa anakuja. We have fun anarudi kwa nyumba yake. Mimi nilikuwa ni ju, eventually I knew. Hakuna uh-huh. venye atakaa hapo. It it was clear. Sasa mimi nilikuwa uh-huh. lazima ningejaribu a a. Na na usijaribu kunikunguza wewe. Unasikia? Hai. Hello Angels, I'm Angel Wanjiko and I'm here with my producer Collins Angels to go on road to a million subscribers. Let's keep on subscribing so that we can get there. And of course, welcome back to the reunion show. Tunajua what goes down here. Mambo ni live live kwa ground. Na Angels, of course, mnaona hadi tumaamua kuketi chini because mambo hapa haiendi vizuri sana. Na leo nimeamua lazima tuongee to record because usually we don't do this part we don't continue with the conversation on camera but we continue with the conversations with them so sasa for those who don't know what is happening here i am here with eva eva came to the show and she was saying akona mtoto wa mr levis mr levis has a wife wameoana officially for 20 years but they have been together for even a longer period of time they have two children together wako na familia yao ni watu wa kanisa wanajenga nyumba na family and everything so everything is happening for them right now but everything is not happening for you right now because you are stuck and you have bills to pay and you have a kid to feed na baba yake ameenda absent and hayuko hapo na sasa wewe Mr. Levis yes we want to be honest with each other sure tumepitia simu yako na tunapata kuna msichana mwingine anaitwa Ana sasa hata mimi nimeshangaa who that person is unasema ni mtu ambaye mnamjua kwa familia But wewe una una unamtambua huyo huyo mwanadada? Mama Jane, yuo ni yule ana. I, I think nasikia na, na, ni kama anaitango uh, scholar jina nyingine. But she's the same same woman. Ni mtu unajua. Si at there is anything between me and uh, Oh, you ni scholar. Sasa ulichange jina kwa simu ndio nisijue. In si, case nitapitia simu yako, si ndio? Uh, Sio hivyo uh, Rose. The, the reason why namtumia na sana na, ukiona ni message tu alituma yenye maybe at understand at me understand kwa nini akaniita dali hata sikuwa na hiyo akili kusema ule ukweli mm. kwamba maybe maybe she had something anafikiria but to me hakuna mm. ile pesa namtumia ni ile tu and in fact we should congratulate that woman kwa sababu anatusaidia in our absence hakuna aje mm. na kocha sana jina mbili apart from jina najua we are baptizing ngine mm. Eh, yao ya kimapenzi. Na a, 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 apana, apana, si ya kimapenzi ma, 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 mama Jane. Mimi aliniambia anaitwa Ana. Mm. But nimesikia mara kadhaa akiitwa Skola. So, vile tu nilimsave the first time eh, mm. sijai sijai ni Skola. Sasa mimi aliniambia ni Ana. And hata ukiangalia hizo transactions zote, siwezi kuwa nimetumia mtu pesa mingi hivyo without any deal. Ni biashara. Sasa nabona ukuniambia mimi. So huyo ngoja sasa niulize huyo ana ama huyo skola ni because ni, kwa simu yako nikipitia niliona kuna baba skola okay Huyo ni brother yake sasa Na kwa nini si umemsave baba skola that means huyo ni baba yake Ah ah sasa ule ni brother yake anaitwa baba skola ako na kastana kanaitwa skola huyo hata huyo anamjua ni wa church member Ah sasa huu an ni sister ya huyu na au huyo sasa baba skola and the entire family ndio walituonyesha hiyo plot tununua and you are aware of that sio unajua ndio hao walituonyesha ile plot mahali tumenunu in fact wanajenga their neighbors So hata wao wanajenga hawajamaliza. So most of the time wakati sijaenda natumia nga huyo ana wakati yako huko huyo wanaita skola. So mimi namtumia kwenda nini? Lakini hii mambo nimeona ameandika ati ya mtoto sijui nini hapana. Mimi hiyo ni mtoto wake tu aliniambia ni mgonjwa. Eh wewe unasema yeye ana ni single mother, si ndio? Eh eh ni kulingana. Clearly according to how you are talking in family ambayo mmejuana nayo for a very long time. Yes, yes, yes. In fact tulijulia tulijulia kwa kanisa. Yes, ni kweli mama Jane. Tumejuana kwa kanisa. Okay. Yes, That's... so we have built that relationship ya kuwa we are we are all, uh, we go to the same church and uh, they are under me because I'm their chairman. Okay. 
Okay. Yes. Sasa wewe relationship yako na Ana ni nini? Are you lovers? No 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 no. Hapana, hapana. Mm. Tafadhali tusiende that that that, that, that route. Let us Nataka ask. Kujua ukweli. Mm. Uh, 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 Nataka kujua ukweli. Uh, uh, mama mama Jean, uh, tume, tumepigana sana leo na isifike tu. Mimi tangu niwajue hiyo familia sijaisikia huyo mtoto ameitwa Ana. Sijaisikia. Hiyo ni yako. Sasa, na yeye. Unajua mimi sijai mwitisha ID nikajua. Hapo nataka kwao. Sasa iko haja gani unapitia kwa kufanya nini? Sasa hii maneno baada ya turekebisha maneno wewe una, unaendelea kuifanya ikuwe kubwa zaidi. Sasa kupitia kwa kina uh, kina baba Skora na kina mama Ana. Sasa zieka zikakuwa kubwa. Sasa wacha ziendelee zigo. Haina haja, haina haja. Si umwambie tu aache hii maneno. Na nikuulize hmm? because you are saying that girl yeah. akona mtoto wake ni mchanga bado. Eh, si si mkubwa vile. Lakini sasa hmm. unajua sisi wanaume tu hatujuangi ku estimate hmm. ma, miaka. Okay. But si mkubwa vile. Sa- just a minor. Aya, sasa mm. yeye anaishi kwa familia yao? Hapana. Uh, anaishi wapi? Hmm? Anaishi ngi peke yake. Si anaishi, anaishi peke yake. Mama 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 Jean. Hmm. Anaishi hmm? peke yake ya. Eh, lakini naona hata mama Jean anajua. So, lakini. Mm. Mm. Huyo wewe unajua hiyo information yote kumhusu huyo msichana? Sasa na wewe kwani umekuja umeingia hii maneno ya kuniharibia boma pia? Hapo kuna kakizungu fulani. Mm-hmm. Kwa huyu mtoto akitoka kwao akufukuzwa aliamka tu eti siku moja tu mimi naenda kujikalisha sasa si ni mtu mzima kuna shida hata wazazi wake hawajui analipa nyumba mtu mzima ni na survivaje kwani yako na miaka ngapi mimi sijui miaka lakini yeye ni over ni over 20 25 hapo Hmm. Ni mtu mkubwa unajua unaweza angalia mtu tu ujue hmm. huu si mtoto hmm. kwani kuna mtoto akona mtoto si hmm. obvious 22 years sasa unaona hata anajua mimi sijui kama ana 22 ako 22 years afadhali yeye anajua ni, ni na sijasema ni ana nimemuita ana juniana wako hey, hey, ana, si ana skola. so ana ako 22 years na ako na mtoto mdogo saizi na ametoka kwao ameenda kujikalisha hey, bila tu mtu mzima anaweza fika mahali wazazi, hey, wazazi wake walisema nini kuhusu yeye kuhama nyumbani kwenda kujikalisha mi nasema tu kenye nilisikia. Na nani? Na nani? Wewe hata wewe unaongea maneno ujui. Ni kitu mama yake mwenyewe ndiye alisema. Sijasikia kwa mtu. Mimi sipendangi udaku. Eh? Akasema ana alienda kwa nini? Aliamka tu siku moja. Eti anaenda kujikalisha. Jua kona mtoto haezi kaa kwao sijui nini 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 nini. Mara sijui wanamkazia sijui nini. But akona haki. Kwani kukujikalisha ni kuna makosa gani na akona haki na ni mtu mzima? Wazazi hmm. wake wanajua baba ya mtoto wake ni nani? Hawajui. Eh. Mm. Hakusema ama hawakumuuliza ama what happened. Sijui kama hawakumuuliza lakini hawajui. Hmm. Okay. Mm. So familia hawajui baba ya mtoto ni nani? Mm. Sasa wewe unamsaidia huyo anana naona mnaitana dalu kwa si. Get me right. Si, si msaidi yangi. Ni hiyo tu mara moja mm. aliniomba usaidizi mtoto ni mgonjwa. Na vile unajua ni kweli ana hivyo huyo anasema ana hayuko ka, mm. hayuko kazi. Unaona? So akanililia kama chairman wa kani, wa kanisa. Akaniambia e, mtoto ni mgonjwa, nikamuuliza ni mtoto mgani, akanitumia mimi huyo mtoto wake hata simjuangi. Mm. Na lakini najua kana mtoto mdogo. Akanitumia picha na ndio nikadelete hiyo picha nikajua ju, kwa sababu nataka ku, ku, kuhifadhi doa yangu hiyo picha nitoe kwa nini kwa simu juu bibi yangu anachukuanga simu ya yangu so mimi simu yako nachukuanga wapi sasa unajua simu yako. siendangi kuoga na simu nikienda bafu najuanga kama unachukua sijaishika siwezi jua sasa sijaishika simu yake akienda bafu hiyo si siku na siku anachanga simu naenda e, nje e, 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 wacha kuweka maneno kwa mdomo yangu na nini eh hata nimekuwa nani unless Sao. mtu apige kama ako mbali nitachukua mm. nimpeleke eh e, si ndio hiyo ni kushika na si ndio nimesema anashikanga hiyo okay. si ni kushika eh mama jeni hiyo si kushika simu sasa ndio manake nikatoa ile picha mm-hmm. ku avoid nini mm-hmm. mambo kama haya okay. isipokuwa hata we, kwanza wewe ndio umeleta hii maneno yote wacha okay. nikwambie okay. kwa sababu kama unge soma hizo me- message hata mm-hmm. sijui naye ni shetani mgani zikakaa kwa simu mm-hmm. unge soma hizo message sasa hii mambo yana ingekuwa okay. tulikuwa tunaongea mambo ya huyu mwenda wazimu hapo unaleta mambo yani hapo na, na, na we ni kwenda wazimu juu wewe ndio umeleta hii mambo yote sasa tungekuwa hata tungekuwa hata tunaenda Ayi? mkutano nilikuwa na mkutano leo sasa hii ni saa ngapi wacha na mambo na mikutano hata utaizi attend sasa kwa nini chairman chairman Mbe, wa kanisa mpaka uchunguze kwa church eh. sasa anachunguza kwani unaenda kupeleka hii maneno kanisani mpaka nipeleke juu sasa imezidi mama je ni nini eh 
mtu zianavunikanga uchi ya bwana yake kwa ya bwana yake kama bwana ameshatoa uchi sijui wapi sijui wapi sijui hiyo ilikuwa nilikwambia hiyo maneno ya yule wachana hayo huyu wachana yeye kabisa mimi sasa sikutetei mara ya kwanza unaona nilikuwa nakutetea sababu kwa sababu unanijua mimi sina maneno mingi kutoka miaka 20 sasa unaibu sasa mama jeni nini Sasa umekasirisha bibi yako. Sasa anakasirika bure kwa sababu. Na in fact kusema ule kweli, mm. hii mambo yote sida yetu, sida yote hii yote ni yenu nyinyi wabibi. Ah, sasa acha niulize Eva, wewe unasema huku huku utuma mtu atoke kwa ndoa yake, si ndio? Mimi sikumwambia atoke. Uh-huh. Ai, si yeye ni mtu mzima. Mm. Na mimi ni mtu mzima. Tulikuwa tunajua kwenye tunafanya. Mm. Mimi sijakata nilikosea. Nilijua ako, kwa ndoa na bado nikaingililia. Mm. Nimekubali nilikosea. Maji yalishamwagika, tulishapata mtoto. What mm. next? Mimi hiyo ndo kitu nilikuja. Enjo no wonder nilikukontact. Yes. What next from up? Okay. Sasa mbona huku ni huku ni ulikuwa naingiza Enjo nini? Enjo ni mtoto. Nilishindwa kukufikia. Nikakupigia, nikakutext. Karibu miezi karibu 5 6. Sasa ile nakuuliza ile siku nilikupigia simu wewe au kusika. Mimi nilienda kuita Enjo. Niliita Enjo mimi. Wakati ule na Mombasa wiki mzima. Ulienda Mombasa wiki mzima. Achana na mimi kwenda Mombasa. Nilita Enjo kumuuliza. Acha nikuulize Eva because tukianza show you mentioned something na ukasema you found out ako na bibi after a few uh, after mmekuwa pamoja for a while lakini ulikusha fall in love with him. So this man unampenda. Eh eh sema. Sema saa hii. Honestly. Hawezi kwa sababu unafikiria ako na watu wangapi huyu? Hii weekend akaona Ivasha. Ile zile safari rale ziliisha juzi. Mm. Yeah? Alikaa huko hizo siku zote. Ulikuwa nataka nikae kwa nyumba yenye ukuji. Haezi kata. Tunasikia. Safari rale yote amekaa huko. Na sikuwa na eh pole pole alienda kuona safari rale. Sasa mama 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 jeni tunajaribu kusuruhisha hii maneno. Ulijuaje alienda kuona safari rale? Unajua ananikasirisha na anafanya mpaka niseme vitu sifai kusema hapa. Oh. Eh? Ananikasirisha Ananikasirisha kwa sababu <laughs> eh ananiaccuse ati mimi niacha mtoto mtoto ambaye sijui kama ni wangu Sasa, lakini yeye yeah, anaenda na Bali tufanye DNA Acha before tufike hata kwa mambo ya mtoto uli. let us discuss about your relationship na yeye because clearly according to vanya nyinyi mnaongelashana hapa ni kama kuna mauchungu fulani Sana sana Mwe. kwanza mimi nimekasirika sana Wewe unampenda Wapana mm. Napenda bibi yangu mm. bibi, Naweza jipenda msichana na, na niko na bibi mimi napenda bibi yangu Rose na anajua hivyo miaka 20. Mm. Uwezi kama mtu na mtu miaka 20 kama umpendi. Mm-hmm. Sasa huyu sijui alitoka wapi from nowhere tu anataka kuja kuniharibia ndoa. Mm. Sasa so wewe haumpendi. Ah. Unaweza penda mtu anaenda anakaa Mombasa wiki mzima, mm. anaenda na Ivasha wiki mzima na I'm very sure ni watu tofauti. Sasa explanation ni either unanipenda ama unipendi. Acha kushinda ukiexplain vitu waziishi. Kupendi. Sawa, mimi nimesema mimi nakupenda. Mimi nataka u support mtoto wetu. Mimi napenda bibi yangu. This is my wife, legally married. Mm. Wazazi wanajua, kila mtu anajua na huyu ndio bibi yangu nampenda. Na okay. So yeah. wewe sijui unatokea wapi kwa ndoa yangu? Wewe vanya ulitafutana uli, uli na yeye vanya muliandi au seminar ya my youth. Ni nini uliona kwake ukasema acha ni, ni get to know this lady? Sasa hii ni maswali gani? Sasa unaniuliza bere ya bibi yangu. Sasa si unataka tu kuniharibia hii ndoa pia na wewe Enjo. Eh? <laughs> Sasa kikwaribia ndoa. Huyu bibi yangu nimekaa na yeye miaka 20 nataka tu ndoa yangu iharibike. Sasa si tunafaa kuongea. Ama ama wewe ninafikia huyu msichana Eva. Wewe ndoa yetu ni wewe umeharibu. Sijaharibu. Wewe ndio umeharibu hiyo ndoa kabisa. Si maneno acha tu tuende tuongee kwa nyumba. Acha tu malizane tu na. Kwa nini na yangu muende mkaongee yenyu. Mimi uniambie. Na huyu. Na huyu. Mimi kenye mtafanya hapa umetoka hapa mimi sitaki kujua. Mimi nataka tu solution ya mtoto wangu mwenye alinileta hapa. Sasa Mr. Mr. Levis, uh, ni, niambie tu kweli because sasa tuta have to have this conversation. Wewe si ndo ulimo approach ukamwitisha namba yake? Okay, hiyo ni ukweli, hmm. ni, ni sawa. Na, 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 lakini hii maswali lazima uniulizie hapa. Hautaki tu, tuongee? Sasa mbele ya bibi yangu na unajua bibi yangu nampenda. Sasa lakini hmm. itabidi ukwe honest juu kama ako hapa na tunataka kujua Bibiangu, mambo. Mimi naomba tu ni, wacha niongee tu kweli na unisamehe. Na kama kuna kitu nimekosea tu wacha tuongee maneno kwa nyumba na wewe. Mm, sawa sawa. Rose nakupenda sana. Kuna nyumba tunaenda kuongea. Sasa kwani tunaenda wapi tukitoka hapa? Sisi tunaenda kwa nini? kazi bure kuongelesha. Kwa nini tena sasa? Miaka 20 itapotea tu hivyo. Sasa labda tuongee mbele ya wazazi. Sasa wazazi tena wameingilia wapi? Najuu si kuoni vizuri na kuonea itini. 
Wale wasichana unashindanga eti wanakubebea sijui ni ni au ni mail sijui ni ni kwa kanisa. Yo eh chairman a patron wa youth. Patron wa youth lazima unapendwa na hawa watu wa youth kwa sababu ya Acha ni ulele bibi yako something. Let me ask her something because she is now talking and umesema kuna watu kwa kanisa wewe una ulikuwa unamwamini si ndio? Ndio. Ulikuwa unaamini bona yako unajua ni mtu mzuri ni mtu anaeheshimika. Miaka zote nilimjua. Umempatia hiyo responsibility hata aki, aki hang out na my youths wa wakae wa spend time together you don't you never had a problem with it. As a patron. But sasa sasa hizi ukifikiria ukiangalia back do you feel like kuna kumekuwa na issue? Do you feel like maybe amekuwa too close to maybe some ladies kwa youth ama kuna mambo yenye anafanya yenye pia wewe unashuku hiyo ndio kitu nimejua leo ah. mm-hmm. nimekuja kujua leo na hata kikataa hata kataa pige magoti ya scroll afanye nini ni vitu anafanya Ma- mama jane na hata tukifanya uchunguzi na wewe tutapata ni ukweli mm-hmm. sasa tena mnaenda kufanya na uchunguzi gani juu mimba kwanza ilikuwa ya huyu mm-hmm. ya ana Ana mgani? Atujui atu wangapi tena wako na mimba? Mm-hmm. Ama wangapi wanatarajia kupata mimba? Mm-hmm. Ama kushika mimba yake? Mm-hmm. Mimi siko tayari kulelea wa mama wengine watoto. Hakuna mtoto unalea? Sisi yeah. tumelea watoto wametosheka. Na, na, na nani? Wa, n- yeah. Mtoto wangu na nani? Naishi hapa ama utalea tutaenda kotini. Si DNA ndo unataka ndo confirm mtoto ni wako. Tutaenda. So wewe because I can clearly see you, you need his help and everything. Wewe kwako venye mliendelea na hiyo relationship mara ya kwanza uka fall in love na yeye, si ndio? Mhm. Ulimwambia unampenda? No. Mm. Why? Mm. Ni da wife na nilikuwa na job yenye ameni place. Mm. Sasa mbona nijieke kwa situation kai hiyo? Mm. No wonder venye tu tulianza nilisema. Mm-hmm. Mimi sikujitenga ati na watu wengine mm. those who showed interest mm. just because tulikuwa na eh. Okay. It was clear mm. he's not committing to me. So, he's not taking me as a second wife. Uh-huh. I'm just mdu wa ku have fun na eh. Na ulikuwa unakuja kwa maisha yangu kufanya nini so, kama uh-huh. unajua hivyo? Mimi nilikulazimisha uingie kwa yangu pia. So wewe ulikuwa unataka kukua second wife wake ungekubali. Eh hivyo ndio alikuwa anataka kulingana na vile anaongea. Uh-huh. Na siwezi siwezi kuwa wewe. Nani anaweza wewe mtu kama wewe? Eh? Mtu anakuja kuharibu dawa ya mtu na unasema ati kwanza huyo mtoto huyo mtoto unasema ni wangu. Mbona hutaki story ya DNA? Eva, Eva, let me let me say something. Mm-hmm. So ulikuwa unajua kwa Nabibi and you were comfortable with that but you fell in love with him. Yeah, so venye ulikuwa pamoja na yeye kwa hiyo relationship yeye hakukommit, si ndio? Yeah. Venye yeye haku commit lakini mlikuwa pamoja wewe bado ulikuwa unaona watu wengine? Yeah, true. Si unasikia? Na na nilijua tu. I knew. Nilijua tu. I I knew. Hiyo kitu nilijua. Hiyo kitu nilijua. Nilikuwa nikae hapo nikifanya nini na wewe hata uwezi ka hapo. Una hata uone aibu mbele ya macho yangu. Ukisema na mke. Si ulikuwa na mke. Ulikuwa na mke, mimi ulikuwa nataka nifanye nini? Sasa sikiza, huyo mtoto upelekea hao watu naniambia. Ne, na tunaenda na kotini. Na nani? Mtoto ni wako na utalea. Kwanza simu ni mimi. Utalea, wewe acha na simu yangu. Simu yangu. Hii simu hii this is my money. Hii ni hii ni pesa. Hii ni pesa yangu. Mimi hata naweza ikanyangia chini. Kanyage na ulipe. Nipe pesa. Simu nilinunua pesa yangu. Eh? Unasikia mtu anasema ati unasikia mtu anasema ati ati alikuwa anaona watu wengine na anasema ni take responsibility za nini? Siko na bibi na familia mimi nilikuwa nifanya nini? So, no, yeah. it was clear mimi nilikuwa clande. Yeah, you we were going to take things serious. So, nilikuwa nikae hapo nikikosmailia kila saa. Alikuwa anataka ukuwe faithful to him. That is what he wanted. Uh-huh. Nikuwa faithful kwake uh-huh. na yeye kila saa anakuja. We have fun anarudi kwa nyumba yake. Mimi nilikuwa ni ju, eventually I knew. Uh-huh. Akunda venye atakaa hapo. It It was clear. Sasa mimi nilikuwa lazima ningejaribu a a. Na na usijaribu kunikuguza wewe. Unasikia? Hai. Ulikuwa unataka nikae hapo nikifanya nini? Na si tu ungenio. Ungenio? Kama usikuwa ni kwa ulikuwa unakuja kwa maisha yangu kufanya nini? Kuniharibia maisha yangu. Kuniharibia kwa yangu. Si ungeenda. Nani alikwambia ni approach? Si ungeenda. Wewe ulikuja ukifanya nini? Ulikuwa unakuja ukitafuta fan, ukapata mtoto na umempata na utalea. Sina mtoto na wewe. Huyo unataka au hutaki utamlea? Mimi ndo nakwambia kotini kotini tutafika. Sitalazimisha kulea mtoto si wangu na sitakubali. Mimi ndo nakwambia tutafika. Sitakubali. Wewe unataka au hutaki? So sasa clearly because kwa hii relationship penye mlikuwa anga mna argue sometimes. Huh? Unaweza kaa na mtu kama unasikia vile anaongea hapa. Huyu ni mtu akukaa naye kama amjagi. Huyu hata ni mtu unaweza kaa ukitandika. Most of the times mimi ndo nilikuwa nasikiza shida zake za nyumbani. Ndio nakwambia mimi nilikuwa nakuja kwa sababu wewe nakwambia wewe usiongea. Nilikuwa nilikuwa nakuja kwa sababu ulikuwa nakuja juu ya shida zako za nyumbani. 
si tunasema ukweli si tunasema ukweli tuseme unataka ku make sure unataka ku make sure nikitoka hapa umeniharibia doa si ndio uta take responsibility i won't tutafanya tutapelekana kwenye tutapelekana sasa nikuuliza Eva because for you to be with a man for 3 years na mtoto wenu sasa yako 1 years ndio clearly kwani kwa relationship yenu hamku kwa mna mnaongea kuhusu nyinyi wawili nyinyi wawili tuliko tunaongea did he promise you things no he did not hakuku promise anything hakuku ana ni promise anything there was nothing guaranteed no anda it was like for me lazima ningeendelea kuona watu wengine potentials hutas for me time ningepata mtu wako serious unaongea tu watoto wengi watu wengine potential watu wengine potential unasikia vile unasikia vile anaongea Unasikia vile anaongea? Unasikia vile anaongea atu watu wengine potential? Eh? Wewe nime, ile mambo nimekufanyia, ile mambo nimekufanyia wewe. Hiyo ndio point. Na you made it clear. Umemfanyia mambo gani yeye yenye nakuumiza hivyo akisema akiongea kuhusu wanaume wengine? Huyu mtu acha nikwambie uh-huh. eh? na nitaongea ukweli tu na uh-huh. bibi yangu anisamehe. Huyu uh-huh. mtu tukichukuana uh-huh. eh? Hakuwa hata na makao. Alikuwa anakaa na msichana rafiki yake. Uh-huh. Mimi nikamchukua nikampeleka nyumba. A one bed, nikampeleka bed sita akakataa. Imagine a one bedroom house. Uh-huh. One bedroom. Mimi nikachukua pesa yangu nikamlipia. Nikavani hiyo nyumba kutoka carpet kila kitu. TV iko kwa nyumba yake u, ukiona ina, 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 inatoshana ukuta. Eh? Pesa yangu. Hii simu ni kimni kwanza hii simu inanikasirisha sana. Hii simu mimi ndio nimenunua na pesa yangu. Niko na receipt kwa nyumba. Yes. Niko na receipt kwa nyumba. So umemweleve tu umemfanyia kila kitu. Nothing to something. Yes. I'm in fact I'm very even sure hizi nguo amevaa it's part of my money. You see? Huu mtu nimemtoa from nothing mpaka mahali amefika. Eh? Sasa hiyo sorry to say this bibi yangu akiwa hapa. Though mimi si kwa burden kwangu. I was still helping my my family na hajawahi kosa kitu hata siku moja. So what was your huh? reason for you to help her all that time kama hauko unamtaka? Sasa unajua sijui kuma nilikuwa na watu wengine na unasema huko unanitaka. So clearly huko unaacha kwako. Mbona huko unataka niende na watu wengine? Na huko unioe? Na sasa wewe ulikuwa unanifuata nini kama uko na watu wengine? Ulikuwa unanifuata nini? Yeye alitoka kwake akakuja kwa mwingine. Si wewe ulikuwa unaacha kwako unakuja kwangu. Si ulikuwa unanipata kwangu. Pesa yangu atanirudishia huyu. Ile pesa huyu huyu mwanamke ile pesa ametumia yangu atanirudishia. Unajua ametumia pesa yangu ngapi wewe? Eh? Ile pesa umetumia yangu hiyo nyumba yangu ningekuwa nimemaliza saa hii. Ingekuwa imeisha. Ndio mtoto ndio anaanza kwa sababu pesa imekuwa imefika. Hiyo nyumba imefika hapa kwa Rinto. Ingekuwa imeisha lakini huyu ile pesa nimemtumia kwake. In fact hata ni Mungu tu. Juzi tu alikuwa ananiambia ati nimpeleke college na nilikuwa nishakubali. So wewe were you there to distort him his money? Exactly. Yes, that's the word. Hakuna mm. usiona yeti kama usiona yeti kama kuna kitu kingine. Ni ni pesa yangu. I'm not justifying anything. But kama binadamu nilikosea, nilisema nilikosea. Intention yangu si kuharibu marriage ya mtu. Ni hiyo hakuna kitu kingine. Unasema si intention si kuharibu ni nini? Ndio ulikuwa married. Mimi si kuwa married. Na unaniambia ni nani liharibika? Wewe ndio ulikuwa kwa marriage na yeye si mimi. Kwa hivyo wewe ndio uliharibu marriage yako si mimi. So, Niliharibu na nani? Niliharibu na nani? Unaongea una nini wewe? Acha nikwambie. Haribu. Let me ask you something because mm-hmm. sasa wewe clearly hapi viko kuna shida kubwa sana. Mm-hmm. Muliko sana because he found out na aka find out wewe uko na watu wengine exactly. na unawaona. Yes, exactly. Ndio maana ukaacha kufanya everything with yes. her. Yes. Uh. yes. Uh. Kabisa na asita wahi and I'll never again. Okay. okay. And I'm disagreed on. Uh-huh. He wanted me to be loyal to him uh-huh. without any guarantee of ever ataka angeniambia in future mm. angeona kitu ikifanyika mimi na yeye mm. mimi penye nimekwambia tukianza i was in love with this guy so saa hiyo at that point hata angeniambia i want to marry you as a second wife ningekubali na sasa tukua na mtoto we were okay we were happy lakini sasa venye he made it clear there is nothing between us sasa alikuwa anasikia vibaya juu mimi i'm entertaining other people na yeye anataka akuje i have fun arudi kwake lakini if i do the same thing i'm the problem double standards mm. so sahizi so wewe because clearly eh uh, unasema mtoto ni wake na unataka take responsibility and that's why tumekuja sindo yeah. uh, tukiangalia kwa simu yako kama utatualao tupitie tunaweza tukaona kama Kabisa. maybe 
Uh, ukona mtu mwingine ambaye maybe anasema sijui endo mzazi ama do you have other people because haujakataa umesema yes. uko na watu wengine sio sijakataa uh-huh. uh-huh. lakini sasa wana uhusiana jina history wana uhusiana tena kwa sababu hakuna tunafanya DNA okay wana uhusiana kwa sababu hao ndio walifanya tukosane na wewe uh-huh. eh wana uhusiana sana peana simu sana do you wanted me to commit na wewe utaki ku commit that is why i committed to you lakini mwenye na committia na yeye ni bure huyu ni bure kabisa huyu ni mtu hata uwezekana yeye Yeah? So uh, commit yeah. kwake but yeye akaendelea yes. kuona watu yes. wengine. You can imagine that. Yeah. How, how, how on earth can you go? How on on Mimi taja ama bado hakuna kitu ana promise. Miaka tatu hakuna kitu amefanya. So nini ni ulikuwa unataka hiyo siku promise? What did you want that I, n- I never committed? Promise me anything you never committed to like me. Like what? Kama nini? Njoo Kenya nilikuwa nataka. Nilikuwa nakupenda. Na venye nimesema saa hiyo ungeniambia story ya marriage. God knows ningekubali lakini the moment nilianza kuona huyu mtu hata anioni as any other thing as an object to have fun i withdrew hao watu unaona saa hii hao watu unaona saa hii wakati ulikuwa unakaa kwa, kwa rafiki yako mbona kuchukulia hata single room ya 2000 mbona kuchukulia hata mattress ya ulisaidia ulisaidia na bado majukumu ijaisha juu mtoto ndo huyo Kenya ulifanya hata zia maana ndio huyo mtoto amekuja utalea venye ulipatia mtoto wako mimi sitaki venye ulipatana na huyu ulikuwa na watu wengine Eh yeah, sema eh sikuwa na watu wengine hapana hiyo ni tukipatana eh sikuwa na watu wengine I started seeing other people mm-hmm. time ilikuwa so clear mm-hmm. there is nothing going to happen between me and him hakuna mm-hmm. future hakuna kitu serious itaenda yeah. hapo nimekutengeneza umekuwa mrembo sasa hao ndio watu watu wakakona wewe usiongee hivyo mpaka hizi rasta na ni pesa yangu That's what we are going to do right now because your phone is the closest thing exactly. we have yes. to finding out kama mtoto ni wa huyu ama si wa huyu before DNA ifanywe si ndio Thank you before DNA yeah. ifanywe Peana peana simu hiyo simu hata ni yangu si yako sijui unakataa nayo nini <laughs> na ukimaliza nana hiyo simu usimpatie mm. unipatie simu yangu mm. Uko na receipt lakini mimi ndio nilinunua Prove it Unajua hata ni duka gani ilitoka Unajua ili nilinunua duka gani Uko na receipt nasema kila kitu You just give do me you your details. Really yes. tutafanya DNA. Hakuna yes. tuta, peana. Tutafanya okay, DNA, tutafanya DNA, but before we get to that, to people. You talk, yes, you talk to you. Tunaongeanga na watu. Tunaongeanga na wanyama, tunaongeanga na watu. Tunataka kuona hao watu mnaongeanga nini? Ah, mi utanifanya ni leo watoto ambao hata sijui ulitoa wapi. Tutafanya DNA. Labda watoto ulitoa huko mama. Leo utalea. Penye wametoka ni wako. Utalea. Na ni haribia doa hapa unakuja una, 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 unaita bibi yangu hapa. Ungechukua simu, ungeshika simu, watu ungekuwa hapa hata saa hii. Jumu ungeendelea ku support mtoto, mimi hata singe aiju hata bibi yako. Tuko hapa juu ulikataa kufanya obligations zako. Hivyo ndo ulitaka tuende, ndo hawa tumefika hapa. Ndio ndio hii ndoa unaelekeza unaelekea kuharibu sasa. Utam, uta, utamchukua bas umuoe. Mm-hmm. Nikiangalia kwa call logs of course kuna watu unaongea nao. Eh naona tu wasome majina tusikie wasome si yangu ulikuwa nasoma wasome angalia kwa hiyo call log nimejaribu si yangu inaangaliwa si 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 simu zangu zinaangaliwa ndio nasema si call log zangu zinaangaliwa ni za watu wengine naona hapa hivi kuna kuna msichana ambaye anaitwa Agi Agi ni best yako nani Soma namba. That is my boyfriend. That is yeah? your boyfriend. Mm-hmm. Okay. Kwa nini umemsave baby, baby daddy? daddy? Boyfriend. Baby daddy. What is your problem? Hey. Na mimi ndio baba mtoto. As she saying, at mimi ndio baba mtoto. Na huyo ndio baby daddy. You are the father of the You see? <laughs> There is only one way to find out. Ijalishi nimemsave nini nimemwambia nini? Umeona ukweli? Ijalishi. Ukweli sijaona. Umeona ukweli? No. Hakuna ukweli hapo. Wacha nikwambie kitu kimoja. Mtoto awe wako asiwe wako. Ni wake. Mama anajua. Ulitembea na yeye. Eh? Mama ya kutembea hiyo nilikwambia tu nikutereka hey, kidogo. Mama mnatembea na yeye, mnatembea pamoja mnaruka mnafanya kila kitu. Ushatembea na yeye. 
ushafanya kila kitu na yeye hata kama mtoto sio wako ama ni wako mimi sitaki kujua sisi hapo ndio tunataka ku prove kama mtoto ni wangu ndio sasa ananiwekea ananiwekea responsibility zenye si zangu kwa nini Tume, tumesema yeah? tufanye dna sasa hebu tuende kwa whatsapp kidogo wataki kusikia maneno ya dna what I'm, what I'm going to do what I'm going to do messages is prove anything acha ni type hapa baby daddy to to mtafuta tu tuone message zenye he's the only person you're talking to okay Oh, wait. Sorry, sorry, sorry. 